It's a silver bota. A silver boot, honey. Yes. Oh, that's that's crazy. That is so weird. With the shades on, I can't, the screen goes black. Like, it's not like it's tinted. The screen looks completely black. Like, even in the clear part. Whoa. I think these are the polarized keys. Ow. Ooh. Child, not the knife. That is so weird. What technology is this? And what? Wow, deprecha, deprecha. And it's just a camera screen. I can see everything else fine. I wonder if I can see my computer. Well, I can see the this the the car display. Why can't I see this? That is so weird. Anyways, hey gems, it's your girl, Mr. Mima, and we are back at it again with another vlog. Okay. Um, I'm sorry. I'm having a moment because. I don't know what it is about these polarized sunglasses that makes the screen look black. Anyways, we're on the way to personal training. Um, I wasn't gonna take y'all, I'm not gonna hold you. I was like, maybe the girls had enough. But I don't have much going on over the next couple of days, so this is gonna be the highlight of the vlog. <laughs> My outfit. <laughs> Me doing squats. <laughs> <laughs> um, I overslept because I went to bed too late, didn't hear my alarm, um, the usual woes. Um, so that's why I'm currently like in a rush. You know, I usually like to start the, the vlog in the house, but this time we are in the car. Um, but yeah, I hope I have a good training session today. Um, Ooh, 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 what's happening here? What's what's going on? Um, I had some boiled eggs and um, yogurt for breakfast. Had my Lani New. Um, there is this other pre-workout that I want to try out. Um, because one I took yesterday, oh, like I took like a pre-workout pre-workout, and it gave me the creepy crawlies. And I'm used to that happening sometimes, but like it lasted like the whole workout session and then I didn't like that. Ooh, 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 oh, sorry car. Um, yeah, I think it's the niacin. There's something in the pre-workout that makes it feel like there's something crawling underneath your skin. And it's supposed to subside after like 10 minutes or so, but it just kept going on. And I was like, <laughs> I was in the gym like, and I was like, ooh, like I'm not taking this no more. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and throw that out. It's on the verge of expiring also, so I was like, it's old. The fact that I didn't finish it is is proof enough that I don't I don't need to take in that. So I have another one that I do want to try. But in, the min, in the, but in the meantime, I will be continuing my Alani New energy drinks. Um, the Alani New pre workouts aren't as effective for me as the energy drinks, so that's why I don't actually do uh, the powder pre workout mix. Um, I think it makes me use the bathroom. I think that was my biggest issue with a lot of pre-workouts. I used to take C4 heavy back in the day, but when I tell y'all, it used to wipe me out. And I was like, you know, it's great for the energy and the pump and endurance, but being dehydrated every single day, like that's actually not cute. <laughs> so I stopped taking that. Um, and yeah, so far the best thing that's been working for me to give me energy for my workouts are the energy drinks. So, you know, I'm gonna drink a whole one. I don't think I could, honestly. I just feel like it's a lot. I already consumed so much in the morning in preparation for my workouts that I'm just like, oh my God. Like the, the less, the better. <laughs> so, um, I think it's from the brand Tone It Up. I got it from Target. Um, I think it's just like, a little caffeine and something else it's not like a crazy crazy pre-workout so hopefully I have good results with that but I just arrived to late gym so I will see y'all on the inside at some point 
That's so weird. Wow. Ooh, anyways. Bye. Hey y'all, um, so I am tidying up the living room because I'm getting ready to film an Amazon favorites video for Prime Day. But I wanted to show you guys this package that I got because it's been sitting here. Oh. Sorry, I was dramatic. Um, but yeah, like I was like, oh, I got to show the girls. Okay, wow. I need a box cutter because this is like not not cooperating. I don't I don't like that. Like why aren't you cooperating? <sighs> Y'all, I mean your girl has been on Amazon. Uh, so I found these new like phone stands that are different from the ones that I usually get. But first of all, why do I need like three phone stands in one room? Like <sighs> So they're just like sitting here. And here I am deviating from the, the topic at hand, but like it's bothering me. So easy put together. I think they have like a screw that goes in here, but like just whatever. I should put this together though, shouldn't I? Yeah, I should. Um, I'll do that afterwards though. So. Where did, oh. So self care, TMI. I got new toys and these are chargers. Period, okay? Because we believe in making yourself happy in this household. Whether you by yourself or not, <laughs> it's gonna be a time. Okay, should we move to... Get the box cutter. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, we're back. <laughs> Why do I keep falling so dramatically? It's those damn um squats. <sighs> Anyway, as soon as I saw these, I jumped. I hopped, I skedaddled to the website so fast to make sure I can get my hands on these. Cause what y'all not gonna do is play in my face. 
like what y'all not gonna do is hit me with the out of stock okay um yeah 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 can you guess what it is can you guess what it is yeah yeah her mm. it's a silver bota a silver boot honey yes y'all know i got like the bronzy gold one last year and now we have a silver one and y'all know i'm still on my silver kick so like this boot with all of my silver bags hello hello and the way it's actually looking like it might be a little cool this fall yeah jamima and boots that's gonna be a thing for sure Ooh, not the zipper wait a minute not the zipper being spicy hold on because that's gonna be a problem i'm not gonna fight you every time i put you on now let's let's get that together oh my god <sighs> brother let me just enjoy this one nice thing like why why you always want to have an issue let me just enjoy this one thing like oh no oh no this has to be defective there's no way i'm gonna have to reach out to these these folk um but before i do that let me make sure that the 11 is a good fit jeez why is it like Oh shit, on. Uh, it's just gonna look slouchy on me. Cause my my leg, God, no. Cause if this thing on the zipper rips off, I won't be able to, ah, this is actually kind of painful. hurts right here i'm so sorry i'm so sorry y'all but it hurts like in the back of the knee because the boot is too tall um yeah and it's gonna have more of a slouchy effect but i'm just like um let me stand up I feel like I'm gonna deal with them just because they're silver and it's, it's hard enough finding boots, honestly. It's hard enough finding boots. Um, and they do fit, they fit my calves. They're actually loose. It's just the back of the knee that hurts right here. Um, anyways, yeah, so these boots are from Eloquii. I think the gold boots were from Trash the Figure last year. Right? So, yeah, it's gonna have to be a slouchy blue on me, and I don't know how that's going to impact the um the material of the boot. <sighs> okay, the zipper is it's a little easier now, so maybe just have to warm up. Oh, who's calling me? Hey, gems. Oh, hold on a second. Blow out the candles before I forget. But um, I'm actually headed to dinner. Um, my face is already done from working, so I was like, whatever. Throw on this bandeau top from Target. Oh, these jeans are at Target too. I mean, these are the Kalana Barfield jeans. I had it taken in at the waist. Um, and hold on. I'm wearing these Jessica Simpson clogs. <laughs> um, and I'm wearing my Kurt Geiger bag to go with them since it's like a cream instead of a white. I figured this bag would go really well, but still add like a pop or something, but not doing too, too much. Um, 
yeah, so that's pretty much the look. I just need to lotion my feet, put on some perfume, and head out. And grab this. Okay. Um, oh, shoot. Yeah, I need to head out. I mean, this has some fun. Wow. Morning gems. It is currently 7 in the morning, and I'm headed to the dentist. I don't know when my life became this, but I'm heading to the dentist at 7 in the morning. Mind you, my original appointment was at 9.50, and they're like, oh, we need you to come in there later, earlier. I have a nail appointment. <laughs> I can't come later, but like, dang, y'all really got me coming in later? I mean, earlier. And it's like, I know I'm up anyways, but like, being up in the house is different than being up and outside the house. Like, being up and active, like, you're doing too much. <laughs> you're doing a little too much for me, and um, I don't appreciate that. And um, I need to go because I'm about to be late. It's the viewfinder as my mirror for me. I actually woke up a little hungry today. And it's like, that's ghetto. The day I can't eat. Well, Kelly didn't say I couldn't eat, but like, who wants to go to the dentist? It's like, you know? And uh, it would have just been too much to like brush my teeth, eat, and brush my teeth again. It's, uh, I'm just gonna starve. Damn it, I need to put this air freshener somewhere else. Cause there's my sitting here, I knock it down. But then I don't have anywhere else to put it where I feel like it'll really impact the room, you know? Okay, I also placed an order on Athleta. That's what I'm wearing underneath, top and leggings. I have some thoughts, I'll share them later. Should I bring you on with me? Why not? Let's go. Put this shade down here. And then I broke a piece of my filling so I had to fix that. The struggle. Okay, so I'm back in the car. Um, this area was numb. She had to go in a second time because I could feel when they were tapping on the inside. All right there. Um, the good thing is, the last time I had feelings, the way I was numb, the loop was like giving this. It doesn't seem to be giving it. It doesn't seem to be giving that this time. Um, and I feel like there's a little tiny droop itch here, but you can't. I don't think you can tell. So the droopage and the Invisalign combination together, like the way my mouth is like watering right now. <laughs> oh my gosh. But, um, yeah, hopefully, well, they say I shouldn't have to go back to the um, <clears throat> dental office until the end of my treatment. So I guess I won't be seeing these folks for the next... 14 months oh my god that sounds insane um the athleta clothes came in an old navy bag and i feel like something about seeing that expensive af athletic wear in an old navy packaging is kind of like threw me for a loop because i'm just like mm, let me find out they're really the same thing <laughs> um but honestly i don't think they are um I'm not really a fan of Old Navy athletic wear. I don't like the material. I can do shorts, but like leggings, most of them, I, I don't like the texture. Um, and I have no issues with the one I have on. Now, the only thing about it is I got this in a 3X. I don't know if it runs to the size or if it fits 
too big. You guys know with the whole working out and 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 ting, I feel like I'm not too sure about my sizing. Um, I need to take my measurements so I can see technically where I fall. But even with that, like I don't always go by the the the, the size chart and what they say about certain things unless the item is non-stretched. So even then, I'm just like mm, I'm not sure because these are too big. Now, I felt that they were too big when I put them on. Keep in mind that I have not tried too many um, athletic wear from different brands because most of them don't have anything my size. So just based on how I feel, like when I, when I wear my Fabletics leggings, putting this on, I felt like it was too big, you know? Um, and as I was like walking around and stuff, like I can just, the way it's not sitting on my body the way I want it to. And I got this in a 3X, so personally, in this particular material, I would have gone down. I don't know if that's something I should recommend for everyone, because like I said, I don't know where I am on a sizing scale. So, yeah, I, I don't know, I'll have to play around with it. But like already, I can tell I like this way better than Old Navy, so. Um, even though it came in Old Navy packaging. <laughs> and clearly they have some affiliation. I think they're, are they sister brands? I'm not sure, but um wow <laughs> i'm not sure but i prefer um athleta over old navy uh, and i got a whole bunch of things from like the sale and final clearance rack situation so that's i'm kind of like a little bummed out because i'm just like you know, I'm stuck with these, and clearly it's not like it's going to fit any better as time goes on. Um, but, I don't know. I'm going to try it. My money's worth it. I'll try to see if I can wear it. Like, run errands or something. I don't know. Um, I got the top in a 3X, too. I feel like the top is real... <laughs> the top is real tight, honey. But, you know, even with Fabletics, like, at Fabletics, I get my tops in 4X and my bottoms in 3X. Um, depending on the material I'm finding out like right now like my motion 365 leggings are fitting too big for me now like they're not snatched they're not like falling off the body clearly like ain't nothing to fall off the bone nothing's falling off the bone like don't be dramatic but they're not snatched like they used to be you know it's like a little a little bit of droopiness in the front that's what I'm getting with this like the crotch area doesn't stay right up against Lil J like she, you know she chilling around the thigh area and I don't like that. I like for my, my leggings to be like, okay. Um, yeah, you see the top, it has the built-in bra situation. This is a bra. I think they call this a long line bra. Do you see the cleavage that this is giving me? This is actually kind of like insane. So like, while I was originally thinking, you know, I should go up a size. <laughs> I should get 4X in these tops. The kind of cleavage this is giving me, I'm, hold on. I'm I'm not even mad, like, cause I everything else might look crazy, but the girls look good. Okay, so I feel like even if it's something that I wear underneath a little jacket like this, it's cute. Okay, like it is giving. She's a runner. She's a drag star. <laughs> it's giving. She's athletic. You know, cause one thing about it, my girls do not hang out together. Okay. You have to force them to stay in a room together. So the fact that they're like bonding like this, cause when I tell you one is on the left, that's definitely my right. You get what I'm trying to say. Okay, let me see if Best Buy is open so I can go pick up my chargers because these little adapter thingies are not working and I need my money back. So I need to make time to go back to Apple. I have some Sephora returns too, so I have to make sure I have time to do that. Um. Yeah, let me see. Cause like I'm not I'm not doing this. I'm not doing this with these people. Oh damn, they're not gonna be open for a while. Okay. I will have to stop by before I head to the nail salon. But yeah, let me head to the house. I'm probably I know I need to edit. I'm gonna go back to sleep so that Did I talk to y'all about that salad that I had last night? It was so good. Oh my god. So I had a jerk chicken salad and I had a jerk 
chicken taco. I had two jerk chicken tacos. Bussin'. When I tell you bussin', like, they get it right. Um, I don't know if you guys remember, but when I went to Dallas, me and Ruka went to this um, suya place, and they had a suya taco. And I feel like the taco's missing, like, a sauce, okay? Some kind of, like, creaminess, something to it. And I was like, oh, no, this restaurant, they got it right. Because that jerk chicken taco had cake, it had a flavor, but it had a sauce, okay? And not just jerk sauce. There was another something in there, and I was like, yo. If they could give this this sauce recipe to the uh nigerians it's a wrap it's a wrap they got it down they got the the jerk chicken taco down it was delicious i thoroughly enjoyed that taco um and the salad was good too yeah and they had hookah <laughs> so will i be back yes it's crazy because based on the reviews i would never have gone but my friends are just and I was like, you know, I'm just going for the vibes. I'll find something to eat. And lo and behold, delish. <laughs> that being said, of course, I didn't try anything like any like real food from the menu. So I'm not even sure what the, the three point something stars coming from. I didn't read the reviews. But one thing about it, that salad is going to hit. And that's what I'm going to order. Yeah. <laughs> All right, y'all, let me head to the house. I feel like so much went on at the dentist today. And normally I love going to the dentist, but I was very anxious today just because my teeth is so sensitive, like naturally. And then because an infant line is more sensitive. And so I was scared that I would be in like so much pain today. And when they were like shaving on my teeth, they don't put anything like they don't numb you. Like they literally just take like in my mind, they take something that looks like a, that's kind of like a nail file and shave between teeth, but it doesn't hurt or anything. Like it was fine. Um, and I was asking like if they would also shave like the tips and stuff because I have like my teeth are very jagged um, <laughs> jagged edge <laughs> oh hold on what's that my teeth are very jagged no edge <laughs> sorry um, and I was asking if they offered services that would you know shave them down um, or if I'd have to go somewhere else for that. She was like, no, like, at the end of the treatment, like, they do the whitening thing. They they do the straightening. They're shaving down. Like, basically, it's not just, oh, Invisalign, then you're out the door. Like, they make sure that your teeth looks good and seamless all together. And I was like, nobody told me that. Like, that's definitely a selling point. Y'all need to tell people that. Because I didn't know I'd be getting all that. Um, I, I knew I'd be getting the retainer at the end of it. But they're like, no, like, you get the, the bleaching trays. And they shave it down. They eat it out, blah, blah, blah like they make sure that you're crisp okay and i love that i'll say oh that's amazing i'm so glad you guys do that but okay yeah i'm going to the house i'm actually getting very hungry and the hunger is trying to turn dead to like hangry okay so let me start talking now while i'm still in a good mood man when i tell y'all the, the the time flew by like what in the ghetto <laughs> um so it's already time for me to leave and go get my nails done. I just called to confirm and we are still on Indeed. I love that. I look crazy because I'm going to my slides because I have to get a pedicure today. Like, whether it's good or not, I cannot go without one. Like, I have to have one. Um, I still haven't eaten yet, so I just grabbed protein shake because I have to stop by Best Buy first. Like, I can't do the whole struggle charger situation so it's time to head back out and hopefully get our lives together <laughs> um let me switch out the battery and my other tripod because i'm gonna take out with me even though last time she didn't want to be recorded so she probably won't want to be recorded again this time I'm gonna leave out here. I'm just taking my phone. If she lets me record, I'll get it. I'll get some like snippets. Um, I'm not doing anything like super fancy or anything, so I think we'll be okay. Yeah, let me go. Hopefully, you guys can hear me. Um, 
work phone. I'm using my regular phone and it's connected to the CarPlay. Anyways, so the nails are donezo. Love them. Ah! Yo, like 14 times today, I told her like, if you ever leave me, like it's gonna be a problem. Like I will follow you anywhere you want to go. Like don't ever ghost me. I can't tell you how many times I've fallen in love with a nail tech and they just up and left. Like they be doing that. They just be dipping, leaving, starting a whole new life. Like what in the witness protection is going on? Oh, look at the Halloween decor. Oh, that's cute. And this house is kind of creepy. So yeah, yeah, it's fitting. But um, I was like, girl, please don't, don't you ever, ever think about leaving because like it's not okay. It is not okay. I need you in my life because, like, honestly, just I was just watching her do the the French chip, and I was like, like you can, ooh. like you you seriously can never leave me ever in your life. Like as long as I'm in Atlanta, like you're my girl. Don't you ever think that you have a choice here? You're my prisoner. <laughs> I love her so much. Was kicking. I'll find her mom, my boy drama. <laughs> right? Ew, I didn't even have that. Having a storm, she's talking to me. Like, it was just a vibe, bro. And she ate the nails. Like, always eats. Oh, Lord. So, there was a couple different, like, French tip chrome sets I wanted to do. So, I'm down to the last one now. So now I have to figure out if I'm gonna keep doing this or if I'm gonna find something new for her to do. So maybe we'll we'll see, we'll see. I might do like a cute little Halloween situation or um, I don't know. I'll do some looking around to see what I wanna do. But this is so cute. So it's, it's French tip, basic French tip with pearl chrome all over instead of just on the tip. And I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed. <laughs> Um, but yeah, so I have a little time before my next, um, obligation. Oh, I told y'all already how the, the, the Tash Rabbit that put up my wall print. Well, he was supposed to come yesterday. We pushed it another day, so it's coming today. But we finished earlier than I thought, so I'm gonna run to, um, the mall to do this Sephora return. Um, I'm also, the Fenty Body, body Butters, they have, like, the trio, what am I saying? They have travel size um butters in a trio set so it has the original it has the like, the vanilla one and then i think they brought back the the gram the cookie gram cinnamon i'm not sure um the one that all the girls love so like that beige container so i'm definitely gonna get that because why <laughs> hello fancy travel set actually i might get two i might get two um and then yeah I got my charges from Best Buy. So, ooh, in black. And so far, so good. We'll see how long it lasts. These cords are extra long. Like, I didn't really didn't need one else this long, I don't think. <laughs> like, it's ridiculous to be long. Anyways, yeah, I will see y'all when I am at Sephora picking up the body butters. And then we'll be, we'll be headed to the house. I haven't eaten, and it's two o'clock. My mouth is in so much pain, y'all. Like, Oh my God. So where they shaved the teeth, it didn't hurt when they were doing the procedure, but it hurts now. And then right here hurts where they did the filling. So that gum area was already sensitive because I think I like, when I was flossing it, I over flossed. Um, and that's from trying to get through the filling to reach the gum. That area was all, that, that filling is all the problem area because it's between two teeth. So like when you, it, uh, uh, so like I feel like you know like they fixed it, but next year's gonna be another thing. Like it's always that same feeling that's an issue. Um, but I'm like I'm not gonna stop flossing. So because that's how I got that issue to begin with. So I'm gonna I'm hoping and praying that water flossing will be enough, and like just doing mouthwash, uh, the antiseptic one, will help keep it clear of like debris and food and stuff like that. But also like keep the bacteria to a minimum. Because like I feel like I'm scarred now. Like how the street floss is just not, it's not doing it for me. So I'm about to be carrying my around my water flosser. If you didn't see my Amazon favorites video, I need you to go watch that now because then you would know what I'm talking about. Um, but yeah, so let me head to the mall. So 
I can go home and get something to eat. Like, I'm hungry, but I'm not, like, starving like I thought I would be. But, like, I definitely need to eat, like, for sure. All right, y'all, later. Ooh, my nails. Yeah! <laughs> bad bitch, bad bitch. Okay, Jim, you're doing too much. tired I am. It's been a day. Yeah, it's been a day. Mm. Anyways, my mouth has calmed down, thankfully, so I feel like I can eat a good meal now. I still have the pack. Um, my guy came and he put my desk and chair together. I'll show you guys that in, this, in a few. Um, he fixed like some of the wall prints, so we're good with that. Um, so I just have to move over my computer and things to the bedroom. I hate that my bedroom is now like my office area, but it is what it is. Like it just, it is what it is. Um, but yeah, first things first, I need to eat because like <laughs> my stomach is on. E, E for empty, okay? Thank you so much to Factor for sponsoring this portion of the video. They are certainly coming in clutch because I am packing to go out of town. So I didn't do any grocery shopping. I scheduled this at the perfect time so that I would have food to eat without having to go eat out. And y'all, I've been doing so good. Like I have not been eating out. And most importantly, I haven't been having the desire like your girl is getting her life to get there and by eating out i mean not eating out i mean like ordering in eating out is all experience it's all a vibe i'm talking about like ordering food to come to the house i have not been doing that haven't had the desire to haven't had the need to because baby your girl always has food in the house shout out the factor okay Thank you so much to Factor for sponsoring this video. If you've never heard of Factor, they are a meal subscription service that brings fresh, never frozen meals straight to your door. If you're too busy to cook like I am, because I'm prepping to travel, but you still wanna maintain your wellness goals, this is a great way to get those delicious meals while doing so. You don't have to wait 45 minutes an hour for takeout to come, your meals are ready in two minutes, no prep necessary. They even have meals on the go that don't require microwaving. So if you're really in a rush, that is definitely the way to go. Now, if you need to add some more nutrients to your diet, you can get that additional wellness boost by also trying their cold pressed juices. They are so good and they're chock full of good ingredients. So head on over to factor75.com or click the link down below and use code MitchaMima50 to get 50% off your first factor box. Once again, that's factor75.com or click the link down below and use code MitchaMima50 to get 50% off your first factor box.
Hey gems. Ooh. I am fresh out the shower. Skincare routine. One thing about it, I'm gonna give Glaze Donut 24-7. Like baby, what's going on? Frenchy Lavender Cloud Body Mist. This has been really my vibe. Um, that's my like nighttime spray as of late, so I'm enjoying that. I officially have a desk back in my room. <laughs> it's so petite, and I'm just like, yo, low key, it might still be too small because like I had a 32 inch before, like, be for real. But I, I'm not ordering another one. This is it. I'm just have to make this one work. Also, I don't want it to take up this whole wall like my old desk used to at my last apartment. So it's just going to be tight, but it is what it is. I have my stuff here so I can show you guys what I got from Sephora. Everything has been adjusted. <sighs> hmm. My entire mornings will now be spent in this room. Wow. I have like four and a half minutes before I need to head um, to my training session. Um, should I take y'all with me? Have I left this apartment this week with y'all? Oh my god, my business line hurts so bad. This is by far the worst tray. And I'm on tray seven. hurt so bad and at first I thought oh like because they shaved my teeth like my teeth is hurting da, da, da. no as soon as I took up the vision line off to eat once I let it sit for a couple more minutes than I should have I was like wait it's not even like my teeth that's hurting on its own it's the invision line and because there's more space between them now it's not noticeable but there is space between it now so now it's like really like when I tell y'all usually it's like focused on one side like maybe this side hurts this side hurts with this tray, especially after that procedure they did, the whole mouth, everything hurts except my front teeth. Everything hurts, bro. 
And I'm just like, dang, I took my Invisalign out to have breakfast. Putting it back in. I don't know if I'm eating again today. I'm not gonna hold y'all. I don't know if I'm eating again. Anyway, child, I really came here to show y'all my goodies because y'all know every week is a trip to Sephora, so like, duh. Um, you guys already saw the, the travel body butters, which is the reason why I went to begin with. So I picked this up. Um, I'm actually gonna go ahead and take one out so I can throw that in my suitcase. Yeah, the one I didn't finish packing yesterday when I should have. Yeah, this is the one that all the girls love. This one's personally my favorite, but this is the only one that you can find online during regular times of year. Thankfully, for holiday season, they made this little trio set, so that's why I went ahead and got two because I won't be able to find this anymore. Especially because these are limited edition, you can't even find this anymore. So I'm so like shocked that they brought this out. I mean, I'm not shocked because that's a good idea, but I am shocked. Oh, the girls love this. This is the graham cookie smelling one. I think it's, they say cinnamon. Literally smells like graham cookies. Um, this was a risk. This was a risk because last year, the holiday beauty blender set was trash. And at first I thought it was tripping until I read the reviews and everyone else said it was trash too. Like, I don't know what manufacturer they went with for the holiday set specifically, but the the sponges were so like ugh. so anyways i got this this time because of course it's on sale um it's not sale but it's on, oh no the sephora sale i'm i'm tripping i could just wait two weeks i'm gonna stock up some more um but yeah so 50 dollar value for three sponges and a cleanser all that stuff and one sponge alone is like 20 dollars i think so definitely bang for your buck I'm scared to try it out, but I definitely have to so that if it don't work out, it's in a bag. Period. Um, the thing I'm most excited about is this NARS palette. Like, I was like, when did they come out with this? Like, I love this time of year because like there's so many like makeup sets, value sets, new products coming out, like in mass rotation, and it's so exciting for the makeup lover in order. So when I saw this, I said, Oh, <gasps> Look at the packaging. I even see the outside. I just saw the inside and it just looks so pretty. And I think I'm going to take this with me on my trip. Like, how stunning. And you guys know I gag. I live, die, breathe, eat for a glowy blush. And all of these are glowy. And I feel like I can use a good four out of these shades. And that's, that's saying a lot because a lot of times... I'm buying palettes for two or three shades. So the fact that I can get a good four out of this, I think, at least three. Yeah, I'm gonna play around with it, but it's just so pretty and I cannot freaking wait to use this. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. <laughs> okay, what's next? <laughs> We're on the time crunch. Also, this little setup, um, I'm not mad at it. I'm not mad at it. Um, also, this little background situation, I'm not mad at that either. Like, especially with all the warm tone lights behind me. All I need is a cute little ring light, put my little square light in front of me, and it might, mm, it might be a new filming setup. What do you guys think? I mean, imagine my bed is made. I am going to take this time to start making my bed again. Not today. Not today. Um, because we have things to do but when i come back for my trip yeah i'm gonna start making my bag because i feel like this would be really cute like he gets vibes no do you guys think or no anyways <laughs> um what else did i get i picked up some lipsticks and um some more like warm shades that i would like also Anastasia Beverly Hills has a new like lip gloss formulation, so I'm gonna try that out. But yeah, I got quite a few lipsticks. Um, I'm excited to try those out. Uh, oh, I got a, a gloss from Fashion Fair. It was so pretty. I was like, oh, this is like right up my alley. Like I love like a caramel, peachy, beigey kind of gloss. 
So we're going to try her out to see if we like her. Um, I got this blush duo from the Gwen Stefani line. Um, I generally go to her line because I really like her lipsticks. What else have I tried from her line? And this is what the blushes look like. I feel like it's a lot of pan. Not pan, but it's a lot of palette from two little blushes. Like, y'all didn't need to make this so big. Let me see. Is it down underneath this or does it pop out? Wait a minute. Okay, I'm not playing with that, but yeah, we're gonna try this out. I feel like something like this would be good for travel because you kind of get like two shades to play around with if you want a smaller condensed kit. Oh my god, my teeth hurt so bad. And I re upped on my refried brow tint because I felt like that was starting to finish um, and I don't want to be left without it. So I got that. I meant to get another mascara, but didn't have it in store. So I might have to do a same day no 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 because if it runs out while i'm there i can just get another one anyways but yeah so that's basically it these were the highlight for sure but i definitely found some great things that i'm very very excited to take along with me but yeah okay it is time for me to put my shoes on and head to the gym guess remembers her uh apple watch today period on period uh love that for me up and we're stuck i left my beauty room a mess last night so i basically just like <sighs> picked up everything was snatching cords rrr, 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 to throw this whole setup here so that i could come and work straight here um first thing in the morning um so yeah that room is a mess and it's gonna stay a mess until i get back because i kind of want to just revamp the whole thing honestly it looks very weird without my computer system there now um plus i have to use, move the printer into here and I need to add some kind of shelving book situation here. I'm thinking about putting a floating um, shelf underneath the TV to put my books. I don't know. I have to figure out what I want to do because I still want my room to have like homey, cozy vibes. Even though I now have this 911 dispatcher help desk IT set up here. <laughs> but um, yeah, so that's it. Let us head to the <gasps> Nami! Talking to y'all looking like this. I'm gonna put my visor on because I'm looking a little cray cray right now. Once again, like the kid is is doing her hair after at the gym so I can have fresh hair for my trip. So I was like, I'm not even gonna do too much. I'm not gonna hold you. These visors, <laughs> when I tell you lifesavers, like, and I'm wearing my glasses today. So hopefully this, oh, it's rainy and like out overcast today so i shouldn't have to worry too much about the sun though low-key my eyes strain more when it's less sunny unless the sun is like directly in my eye is that is that weird is that a thing if anybody else experienced that anyways child baby tea committee gang gang What's up? <laughs> Ooh, yes ma'am. Now she says she's gonna finish her three rounds anyway. She said, I've been paid, but I'm gonna finish this shit today. Gotta get done. Nice. Work. Work. Yes, ma'am. Ma'am. All the way up. Nice work. Full extension. Full extension. All the way up. The two reps. All the way up. Come on. Yeah. Good morning, gems. Um, I'm just realizing that I didn't finish out the vlog. Um, whew, I had a really good workout. It's the next day. My body is crazy sore, like my cheeks. I can feel them growing. <laughs> um, but yeah, I had to rush home because I started planning on my outfit the day before, but I didn't actually pack until like right before my flight. 
So I was like rushing to, you know, get home from the gym, put the things together, make sure I didn't forget anything, and then make sure that I was able to finish editing and upload my vlog before I left because I knew I wouldn't be landing until late and I didn't want to deal with, you know, a late upload or potentially not getting it out. Um, so I was able to do that successfully and still make it to my flight even though I left a little later than planned. <laughs> Um, so I'm glad everything worked out, but yeah, I wanted to make sure I came back and ended out the vlog. So when you see me in the same outfit in the next one, you know where I'm at. <laughs> or if you've been watching and you a real one, you might recognize where I'm at. <laughs> but anyways, per usual, it was a time, it was a key. And I'm gonna see y'all when I go downstairs in five minutes in the next vlog. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Toodles. <laughs>